in this video, we're gonna be transforming a submachine gun into an assault rifle, and it's actually quite good. If you guys enjoy, make sure you drop a like on the vid, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications, check this setup out because I was able to drop a nuke, and I know y'all can tear it up as well. All right, let's go ahead and transform the best P into an assault rifle. This is actually quite effective. I was able to drop a nuke, and I know you guys can tear it up as well. Now, for the first attack, we actually are going to be skipping over the rear grips here. Normally, for SMG build, we would rock a rear grip, but not for an assault rifle setup. We are going to rock a stock, and the Bruin Flash V4 stock is still going to be a great attachment for this conversion, bumping up that sprint speed, aim walking speed, crouch movement speed, and aim down side speed, just to go ahead and make sure we're not stuck in the mud and completely outclassed at those close to medium range engagements. Now for the tuning, we are gonna be bumping up aim walking speed at negative 1.86, and do not forget aim down sight speed at negative 2.71 here. Now we are gonna rock an optic, and we're gonna rock the VOK 4.0, just to go ahead and give us more of an AR long range effect. For the tuning, we are going to be bumping up the eye position. This is going to allow us to have less visual recoil at negative 0.96 and more aim down side speed at negative 0.87. We're skipping over the laser. Obviously, this is more of a long range setup. And we're going to jump right over to the barrel and we're going to rock the 12 inch Bruin barrel to increase recoil control, damage range tenfold, bullet velocity, and hip fire accuracy as a nice bonus. Remember, it's still going to be technically a submachine gun. Now for the tuning, we are going to be increasing that aim down sight speed at negative 0.13 and more aim walking speed at negative 0.42, just so we can go ahead and take it out at close ranges because we're building a setup that can do it all. Close range, medium range, and obviously long ranges. Now for the muzzle, we are going to rock the Syngard MK5. Overall, a great choice here. We can stay stealthy, get behind their spawn, build some streaks and hopefully get that nuke. Now, for the tuning, we are gonna be increasing more bullet velocity at plus 0.97 and aim down sight speed at negative 0.41, taking advantage of close range and longer ranges here. Now, we are gonna be rocking a magazine because again, we want to give it more of an assault rifle feel and the 50 round drum is gonna be perfect for this. Once you go ahead and jump in the firing range, you're gonna see that this gun literally looks like an AR, but it's still obviously gonna be a submachine gun conversion, allowing us to go out at medium ranges with this build. So definitely go ahead and give this a try if you're trying to mix up the current meta. For the main setup, we are gonna be rocking the FTAC Siege in its submachine gun format. Kind of ironic, we're changing an SMG to an AR and a pistol to a submachine gun. We have the SIR-160 rear grip, the 72 round drum, the NST-81 barrel, the DS-70 laser, and the Siege Y. Wire stock. Now we are going to utilize the stun grenades, proximity mines, and for the perks we have on double time scavenger, resupply quick fix, and for the field upgrades we are going to be rocking with munitions box and dead silence. Overall, a phenomenal class setup you guys cannot go wrong with. If you guys do check this out and tear it up, let me know down in the comment section. And as always, drop a like on the vid, subscribe to the channel, and those post notifications. Let's get into the gameplays. All right, let's get busy with the SMG AR conversion. Ooh. Gotcha. Actually, I don't want that secondary. We'll throw that right there just in case. We can do here, man. We got the Bass P converted into an AR. This is actually a pretty interesting build because the Bass P has always been a sub that, in my personal opinion, just played. Whoa, holy shit. Just played better as an AR. Got him. Let's go, baby. You're welcome, teammate. Saves you. Pop this UAV. Figure out where these guys are gonna come. Gonna come this way. I'll drop that right there. There's, yeah, they're literally outside the door over there. Uh, I was a little bit too close. I'm gonna pop my daddy and move up. Yeah, I'm popping the daddy and moving up. Just gonna stun down that hall. I want to say there's probably guys. That. Drop that down right there. Oh. Got him. Hardpoint relocating. Stand by. That. Oh my God. 
Out of advance. Drop that right there. I wonder how many of them are. I wonder how many of them are actually. Go, baby. They're not peeking. Drop that right there. I'm I'm literally not gonna rush this just for the fact that there's legitimately no point to rush this shit. Okay, so these guys are over here. Little wall bang. Throwing a stunner. Oh, would you look at that? Bonds just flipped. Friendly UAV on station. Setting mine. That can go right there. Get ammo down. Dropping ammo here. I don't I do not want to stay over here. Bet awesome. Shit, teammate. Switching mags. Enemy personnel at the hard point. Planting mags. He's on top. Target area updated. It's Move to the hard point. Out. Oh man, where they at? I was about to say, man, I know for a fact I've been mowing these kids down, like, constantly trying to get on that hill. This thing works out pretty good as an AR. I say that as I, as if I wouldn't have known already, but this thing legitimately is a kick-ass assault rifle. And I get, you know, well... That's like the one thing you really can't do with this gun is you can't really run and gun with it because you will get destroyed by like Lockman subs and Vaznet 9Ks. They're gonna have they're gonna have fun with you, but at longer ranges, you can go ahead and kind of outgun them if they don't have like a crazy long range build themselves. You could put in some work with this setup. I got three bombs in the back. Well, technically one bum in the bag. What does he have? Did he dropped a sniper. Locating the next hard point. Get ready. Yeah, those fellas are those fellas are deaf. Oh my gosh. I'm getting chased. Have to go there. I didn't mean to throw that down there, but. It's all good. Nice teammate. Friendly care package on the way. There's a lot of fucking time in this lobby. Like there, there, there is an abundance of time. Well, not an abundance of time like I have like fucking all day, but I could literally, I could get a double in here. I don't have to press. I don't have to rush anything. I'm definitely taking this. They're right outside, too. I say I don't have to rush anything as they're starting to set on the hill. Damn it.
and I get shot from behind. Okay, now we legitimately like don't have time though. Take them out a little bit. <sighs> yeah, he caught me. All right, it's just nuke time. Ain't no way we're getting nothing else done. We don't got like that much time. So let's just wrap this game up. I could have probably had a double. I would at least been like on a 20 if I didn't get shot from behind at the very least. Would have been a good fight. But, you know, I'll take it. We got the nuke. If I didn't get the nuke, we definitely would have lost. So I guess that's a W in my book. Yes, sir. A nice little dude every time i pick up that horrible default setup i get upset that's literally the groza from cold war but just garbage and the groza was really not all that so the fact that he literally has a groza setup just makes me angry jesus this guy has a thermal sight what dude what are these class setups i'm picking up i thought i was making some weird shit but dude some of these guys are willingly rocking bullshit, like, for real. Not too sure where this guy's gonna be coming. Is he gonna pop through this way? He's got to. Okay, he's got me completely messed up. I'll back it up, teammate. That's what you call teamwork right there, baby. Hold on. Oh my god. I'm actually in a really fucked up spot. This is bad. Oh! Oh my gosh. I'm gonna use... Go, baby. I have to fake him out for a second. I, I, I was gonna try to do it. I ain't gonna cap. Covering shit, I need these skills too. I was I was gonna try to steal that shit. I I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I really was gonna try to scumbag that kid and steal those kills. <laughs> I really was gonna try to scumbag that. Keep it moving. Oh, he's got a Kimbo's. What? Nice. Dude, I can't stand this kid with a damn shield. Oh my god. That was entirely too close. Entirely too close.
reason I picked up the lock and shroud to do that. Confirming next hard point. Stand by. All right, he's climbing up on top. They're both on top. Holy shit. Right, he just jumped down. Good shit. Changing mags. You know what? It's not worth it. Our UAV is orbiting the area. Changing mags. We're on twenty piece. Nice. We're getting hit hard. I'm gonna have to, yeah, I'm gonna have to do something with this, uh, within the next hill or two because we are down catastroph catastrophically as far as. Somebody will hit that Betty. I know it. Holy fuck, look at all this. Setting mine. This hill needs to end now. Locating the next hard point. Get ready. Come on, a damn brutal. Reloading. mine. Flash incoming. Actually, let's just get it called in. How did you fail that, brother? Oh my god, it was clutch as hell too, because they got they're at 250. Woo! Oh, I know they're mad as hell. Oh my god. Let's go!